Good evening, everybody. Hi, good evening, everyone. Do you hear me? Or can you hear me? Hi. Yes, I can hear you. You Mr. can hear me? All right, excellent. Hi, Mr. everyone. How How is everything? How are you? How was your day? How was your weekend? Hello. How are you guys? I'm fine, thank you. You're fine? fine thank you? you, teacher. Yeah, and you? I'm okay, I'm okay. I'm okay, I'm fine, thank you for asking. Yes, uh, it's Monday, it's Monday. Everything is uh, really good, really good. Yes, all right. We are about to start. Thank you everyone for joining today's session. For me, it is a pleasure to be here and it is a pleasure to see you guys again. Yes, it's a beautiful Monday. Really good. Really Thank good. you. Thank you, teacher. Let me inform here that there is a storm coming. So we might have problems with the glass later on. Hopefully, it won't give us that many problems. Hold on, give me a second right here. All right, let's continue. Well, let me start by taking attendance. People, let me take attendance. Ana Victoria Galán. No, she's not there. That's okay. Asalia Menali Portillo de Espinosa. Teacher, buenas noches. Por algo, si me llama, porque está lloviendo fuerte y no escucho mucho. Okay, thank you for letting me know. Igual acá, por ese lado había tormenta también. Okay. Si no acaso me desconecto o, o me desaparezco es por eso. No es porque soy mago, ¿ok? Es porque... Why, teacher? It's the Wi-Fi. The Wi-Fi is... Uh, it's, uh, a storm is coming, you know? Yes. And uh, over here yes. in... Uh, Elber in is area. coming. Yes. In my neighborhood, in my neighborhood, there is a... I don't know. Common, commonly, the rotors, they, they burn out. Yes. That's why. I don't know. It just happens. Uh, Brian David Ramirez? Brian, no. Carlos Alberto Orrego? Thank you, teacher. Thank you, Carlos. Carlos Eliezer Dima Soriano? Carlos is not here. Denise Alejandra Zuniga? Present. Thank you. Diana Amilet Maravilla Navas. Diana is not here, okay. Edith Adilia Hernandez Chafón. No. <clears throat> Ismael Ernesto Boyat Solís. Good evening, teacher. I'm here. Good evening, thank you. Jorge Ernesto Hernandez. Present, teacher. Thank you, Jorge Mayra Elizabeth Lazo. Present teacher. Thank you, Mayra. Rafael Anton, uh, Alejandro, sorry. Morales Avila. Rafael, no. Raquel Elizabeth de la Rosa Rodriguez. Present. Thank you, Raquel. Sandra Ives Mendoza. Present teacher. Thank you, Sara Rachel Salazar. Present teacher. And Jancy uh, Andrea Solorzano Castro. Thanks, teacher. Hi, thank you very much. Okay, let's begin. Let's begin. And uh, well, let me show you what we are going to begin with. And we're going to begin with this. I'm going to show you what we're going to do. This is class number six. Okay, class number six. 
Thank you to the ones that uh, worked on the platform and finished the first unit or the first session. Thank you, everyone, for doing so. Thank you. Well, let me do. People, we are in July already. Estamos en, jun en julio. Wow. Like, time is going really fast. There's no way to stop time. It's just, it's moving really fast. Let's practice info future with be going to. Guys, what do you remember about be going to? What comes to your mind when you see the words be going to? What is it? Tell me. Repeat. Is this a plan? I'm okay. sorry. It's a it's a plan, all right. Okay, yes. It's basically basically a plan. We can use we can use going, we can use going to in different situations. Right now we're just working or focusing on future plans or just plans. Yes. Uh I I showed you I showed you how to use be going to in the affirmative, negative, and questions. Remember? Well, here we have the three structures right here. Affirmatives, negatives, and questions. Affirmative. Affirmative, we have the subject, be going to, verb, and complement. For example, you are, is it that you is a subject, are going to be, is are, going to, going to here, verb is visit, your client is the complement. So, you are going to visit your clients. Irás a visitar o vas a visitar a tus clientes. Okay, that is the plan. That is the plan, the future plan. Okay, now, to make or to form the negative form, we alter it a little bit. We make, we make the negative form of B. We make the negative form of B. Are not is not and lastly we have um not those are the negative form of the negative forms of b and those are the same forms we use in the negative form of b going to you see it here look subject the same thing up here be the same then we have not that's the difference going to going to we got it over here verb is the here is here Send is the verb. The report is the complement. So they are not going to send the reports. Ellos no enviarán los reportes. O ellos no van a enviar los reportes. Okay? They are not going to sell. Sorry. They are not going to send the reports. A question. For the question, we invert. We make an inversion. The inversion is between the subject and the person. Perdón, I mean the subject and the auxiliary B in this case. So it's between B and the person. That's the inversion. Uh, affirmative is you are. Question is, are you? Why? Because we do that change. We do that inversion. Look at the example. Is she? Is she? This is the structure for a question. This is not a structure of, for a question. She is is not the structure for a question. Only is she is the structure for questions. Let's continue. Is she going to work on the weekends? Trabajará ella los fines de semana? We don't know. We can say yes or no. How do we answer this question, though? Well, we just simply say, yes, she is. Or no, she is. Not. Yes, she is. No, she is not. That is to, to answer the questions in the future. Okay? Yes. Do you have any questions, people? No, no teacher. No teacher. No? Perfect. Okay, it's, I think it's practice time. All right. It is practice time. Let, we have we have the structures here. You can see them and you can create your own example, but I'm not going to give you any time. 
I'm going to choose people directly in this moment. And I'm going to ask you guys to give me your examples, like right now. Okay, let's start. Uh, Victoria, welcome. Victoria, let's begin with you. Give me an example in the future. Whatever example you want with whatever verb you want. Um, I am going to visit um, the Barra de, San, Barra de Santiago the next month, Sunday. The next Sunday or the next month? <laughs> uh, Sunday. Okay, perfect. Thank you for your example. Yeah, yeah. People, go quickly, all right? Go quickly, go quickly. Let's see, uh, Carlos Alberto. Let's continue with you. Okay. Um, it's Mario going to fix the computer more later or to la later. later? Later. Yes. Okay. Is Mario going to fix the computer later? The example is, is good. Okay. Fantastic. Yes. Diana, try, Diana. An example. Your decision, people. Affirmative, negative, or question. That's up to you. I'm giving you the, the freedom to choose the example, all right? Diana? Hello, teacher. Um, uh, affirmative or not? Your decision, go ahead. Okay. Um, there are, I want to play the soccer. Repeat it, please. Um, They are. Mm -hmm. I go. They to are play. going to going. Okay. Uh -huh. Going to play the uh, basketball. Okay, they are going to play basketball. Okay, yes. basketball. Yes. Thank you for the example, Diana. Yes, okay. Denise. Do you have one? Go ahead. Share with us. Yes. Um. I am not. I am not going to be at home tomorrow. Sad. Yes. <laughs> you have to be at work tomorrow. That's not good. <laughs> I'm sorry, everyone. You have to be at work tomorrow. Let's continue, everyone. Sandra, go ahead. Are you going to... to... to visit the... um? Party fest, or I'm not, I'm not sure about the fiestas, the fest on July. What, what do you mean, the fair? Are you going to come, Santana, uh -huh. okay. on July? You can say to the fair, like. Like the carnivals or to the uh, pies, like traditional. Yes, or something like that, you know. Yes, but the example is correct. Thank you for the example, Sandra. And no, I have not. <laughs> Sorry. All right, let's continue. Jorge? Are they going to eat that? Are you going to, are they going to eat that? Eat, eat that. right? Okay. Eat. Yes. yes. Thank you. Thank you. Ismael. Are you going to visit your relatives on Christmas? Okay. Are you going to visit your relatives on Christmas? No, I am not. They are bad people. Right, they are bad people. <laughs> yes. Okay. Melanie? Wow. <laughs> it's a joke. It's not yes, true. teacher. Good evening. Give us an example, please. Affirmative, negative, or question. Mm, I, I am going to call your sister. I am? I am going to call your sister. Okay. I am going to call your sister. Yes. Mayra. Go ahead, Mayra. Hello, good evening. Good evening. Um, my brother is not going to run this morning. 
Okay, my brother is not going to run this morning. All right. Thank you for your example. Let's continue, Raquel. Elizabeth. No, she's not there. Okay. Raquel Salazar. Rachel. Okay. Uh, are you are you going to uh, to church? Are you going to church and and I uh, Sunday? Are you going are you to go going to church? English no. church. No. church. Are you are you going to go? Are you, are you going to go to church? No. Are you going to go to church? Are you going to go? To church in the Sunday. On on Sunday. On day. On day. No. On day Sunday. No. Sunday. On Sunday. On Sunday. On Sunday. Uh -huh. On Sunday. Yes. Okay. Okay. Thank you, Jancy Andrea. I think Jancy is not there. Elise. No, she's not there. Okay, people, thank you everyone for your participation. That was just a quick review about going to. Now we're going to move on and we're going to start with today's lesson. And that lesson or Inchia. that is going to be, yes, hi. Sorry, no, no lo había podido escuchar. Oh, okay. But do you have an example? It's okay. We have time. Okay. Um, I am going to rest on Friday. Okay, I am going to rest on on Friday. People, we are going to rest on Friday. Hopefully, hopefully, okay? We hope so. <laughs> yes, teacher. Yes. Puedo decir, no, hay que trabajar porque no aplica para nosotros. No. Not good, right? Not good. <laughs> yes. Okay, very good. Look, this is what we have in the book. How do you buy from the places you like? That's a question for everyone. How do you buy from the places you like? Yes. If you're asking me about this question, this question is on the book and I will show you that I am right. Wow. This is more. Oh. So let me show you what it is in the book. The book is here. I'm sharing it with you or to you. Look, today we begin. Today we begin with unit number two. As you can see, it's there on page number 19. If you go to page number 19, you're going to see what I'm talking about or what we are about to start. It says there the name of the unit is online orders and refunds. Online orders and refunds. Do you know what a refund is, people? No, teacher. Anybody? Refund? Refund <laughs> is the devolver. Devolver el dinero de una compra. Yes, exactly, exactly. Reembolso, right? That's what it is. Thank you, thank you. That's refund. Orders. That one is easy, it's una orden, un, un pedido, right? That's what orders are, okay? Online is the thing. So basically this unit is going to be about oh, shopping online and how you get refunds, how you get your money back and uh, different vocabulary related to online uh, shopping, online uh, browsing and everything. And it says here, I will be able to describe and follow the process to buy or sell others online. And this is what I was uh, asking you in the presentation. Brainstorm about the different methods the customers can buy the, uh, sorry, can buy the products your company or your workplace sells. And that's kind of the question I have in the presentation. It's not entirely the same, but it, it has a, uh, it's similar. All right, people. 
Let's answer the question. How do you buy from the places you like? Tell me. How do you buy from these places? What do you do? What's the method? What's the process? Um, maybe using credit cards. Okay, you use credit cards. Okay, that's fine. What else? Direction. What do you mean? Like direct payment? Address. Ah, address. Mm. Yes, address. Okay. My work depends on the address. Um, what else? Can be, which can be uh, cash. Cash, yes, it can be cash, cash yes. Yes. What else? With bitcoins. Okay, now we got the, the virtual money, we got bitcoins. Yes. What else? <laughs> we have we have different methods. We uh with coupons, with with uh, credit cards, debit cards, with checks. Well, you mentioned cash already. Uh, what else? Bitcoin. Yeah, pretty much what that's what what uh we we can use you know to pay in the places we go to or that we like. Now we're gonna discuss. We're gonna discuss the second thing here. It is this. It's on page nineteen, part number two, number one. Let's start. So let's go back. And let me show you what you guys have to offer in your company. I mean, the methods that you use or that you have in your company. Brainstorm about, excuse me, about the different methods that customers can buy the products your workplace sells. You're going to mention the method or the methods that your company uses to sell or to uh, acquire or to get the money from customers. People, tell me about your company. Transference. Okay, transfer, okay. About uh, like like what? Bank transfers? Bank, bank transfers. Okay, what else? In my case, we don't sell any products, um, like a like a store, but um, we use a lot of transactions. Mm -hmm. uh, we work with money, so it's a bank. <laughs> okay, I understand. <laughs> okay, okay. Well, in that case, you you know more about that. <laughs> All right, excellent. Ivo, do you have more comments about it? If you don't, don't worry, don't worry. We're going to continue with the next part. And that is part number two. Even the presentation says says that we have to continue with part two. Look, vocabulary and part three at the same time. Let's go. Okay. We got this, this information on part number two. It says, listen to the pronunciation of the different steps to follow when making an online purchase. Then... Write down the steps in order. Let me pronounce these words to you or these expressions to you. If you have any questions about them, I will clear any of them or all of them. Credit card information. Confirm your information and submit. Select the items to purchase. Uh, go to the online web page. Write your billing address. Check the price. Confirm the method of payment and log into your account. Do you have any questions about this vocabulary right here? What is submit? Submit. Teacher. Sub submit. Submit. It's a very common word that we use uh, online. Mostly on the internet, we use the word submit, which means 
send upload uh, let me send them send it can be send like mvr upload okay subir that is submit yes submit okay MVR. thank you yes upload or upload yes that's what upload. it is mm -hmm. yeah or turn in like turning it como entregar pero no sería como entregar like basically like face to face but yeah yes that's what it is it has different definitions yes more questions people more questions no teacher no teacher okay okay we got it we got it thank you now Let's do what the indication says. Write down the steps in order. Write down the steps in order. On your books, everyone individually, on your books, mention the first, no, mention from the first to the last step in order, okay? People, I'm going to give you a couple of minutes to do this. After that, we will present it, all right? Guys, let's do this. Okay, teacher. Okay. Thank you. People, let me know, okay? I'm here.
Finish, teacher. Thank you. Finish. Thank you, Ismael. Thank you very much. Let me close this for a bit. Give me a moment. I want to find a document right here. Okay, let's begin, let's begin sharing. Let me see, let me read a message here. Uh, it's okay, don't worry about it. Thank you everyone for being here. Thank you for joining today's class. It's a pleasure. Let's move on. Let me show you the book again. And uh, well, let me see. What will be number one, guys? What will be, which one would be number one? What do you think? Guru the online without. Which one? I'm sorry. Guru the online without. Go go to the online web page. Yeah. Guys, do you agree? Do you agree with this one? Yes. Yes. Yes, I agree. Yes, yes teacher. So... Okay. Go to the web page, it's number one. Oh, sorry. It's go to the online. There you go. Go to the online web page. Thank you very much. That is number one. Which one would be the second one? Which will be the second one? Log into your account. Log into your account? Does anybody yes, agree? Yes. Yes. Okay. Log into your account. Log into your account. Thank you. Number three or the third one. Which one do you think is number three? Yes, number three. Um, uh, I don't know. I don't know. It, it's for me, it's confirm your information and submit. I think complete your information and submit. I'm sorry, mm -hmm. confirm. Confirm your information and confirm submit. This information and submit. Mm, I don't I don't think so. <laughs> No, I, I think I, select, select the items. Purchase. Select the items. Okay, it will be select the items to purchase. The pronunciation is not purchase, it's purchase. Chess. Purchase. Purchase. Chess. Like como el chess, el ajedrez, chess. Purchase. Yeah, purchase. Purchase. Chase, si es así, la palabra chase. ¿Saben qué es el verbo chase? Seguir, perseguir a alguien. Por ejemplo, the police is chasing me. Oh, no. <laughs> okay, or the dog, the dog is chasing. Me está siguiendo el chucho. Okay, siguiendo, persiguiendo, chase. Ahí sí es chase, pero en el verbo purchase es chess. Purchase. Okay, purchase. so it will be select... The item, the items, if this is one, or items is plural, the to purchase. Oh, by the way, another thing about the, the, the verb purchase, puede ser un verbo y puede ser un 
sustantivo como verbo comprar y como sustantivo sería compra como hey cuál es tu compra what is your purchase okay that's how it goes what will be number four guys check the price check the price check the price does everybody check agree price. yes agree Check the price. Yes, I'm agree. I agree. Yes. Oh, okay. I agree. Exactly, yes, exactly, exactly. Thank you. Number five, number five. I was to say number four, but no. Number five, everyone. Confirm the, next, uh, the, Confirm the method of payment. Confirm the method of payment. Of payment. That will be this one, right? Let me write it down. Confirm the method of payment. Confirm the method of payment. Thank you, everyone. Let's continue with number six. Which one, which would you think is number six? Credit card information. I'm sorry? Credit card information. Okay, credit card information. Credit cards information. Number seven. Teacher, I'm not sure in the number five. In number five, you're not sure about it. Yes. Yes. Yeah, there's uh, some, yes. something wrong there. <laughs> I think yes. they, they, they should be they should be switched. So you think we'll be here, right? Like credit card information here? No. I think um the write your billing address is um before the confirm the pay because depending in your address the pay yeah, you're Increment. right. Increment. Mm -hmm. It has to be write, write your billing address. I didn't see that one. It has to be before before paying, before the credit card information. <laughs> it has to be like, okay. Information. So we're good right now, right? We're good. And the last one is what will be the last one? Confirm and submit. Confirm the information and submit. And submit. Okay. Confirm your information and submit. Yes. Okay, go to the online website or web page in this case, log into your account, select the item or items to purchase, check the price, write the billing address, credit card information, confirm the method of payment and confirm your information and submit. Yes. I would have used number six and number six. That's fine. That's fine. They can vary. Pueden variar. Okay, it's okay. Everyone, do you have any questions about this one? No, teacher. No? No, okay. teacher. Yes. Let me do this. Sorry. Let me take you back to the... Okay, we finished this part, the vocabulary part. Now we're going to continue with... Do we have a part three? I think we do have a part three. Bring it back here. Okay, let's see this one. So today, today our topic is is kind of easy. It's the most of the pronouns. Uh, it's these pronouns that help us demonstrate that things you know are somewhere like probably closer or nearer or farther, you know, depending. Now, 
We got four examples here in which we are supposed to choose between two words. Guys, choose the words, choose only one, and then we're gonna correct, we're gonna see if you got it or not. I mean, if you got it correct or not, yes? Let's read them in circle or underline the word that you think is correct. I'm going to give you two minutes to do all of them. And then we check one by one. Yes. Teacher, we have to select between the two yes. options. You have, to, you have to choose, you have to choose one, one of the two options, the one that you consider correct. Okay. Yes. Two minutes, people. Okay. Are you guys ready? Yes. Yes. Yes, yes okay. teacher. Okay. Fantastic, fantastic. Yes, teacher. Okay. Let's see. Let's see uh, what we got. I want to hear the read number one, please. Lost because it's, uh, it's, it's read, uh, read. plural. Is it necessary to follow those steps to purchase uh, what some one needs? Okay. It's necessary to follow these or that steps to purchase what someone needs. Okay. I agree with uh, Sara. Do you guys agree with Sara? Yeah. Yes. The correct, the correct answer or yes. the correct choice is those. I am going to explain why, don't worry, okay? Yes, I think you know, but I have to explain it, you know. Let's continue with the second one. Another volunteer. I think that I want to buy that with this. I like it. Okay, I think that I want to buy that or those or that big desk. I like it, okay? And uh, Sandra said those. Okay, oh, no, sorry, she said that, <laughs> sorry. That. <laughs> okay, Sandra that. said that, Sandra said that, and I think everybody everybody agrees with Sandra. Yes. Yes. That, yes. This is the correct answer. Let's continue yes, with agree. number three. Thank you, thank you, everyone. <laughs> number three. Do you, want, do you want to buy this refrigerator? It comes in four different colors. Okay, do you want to buy this, this or this uh, refrigerator? It comes in four different colors. Yes, okay. This is the answer. Okay, yes. Uh, and the last one, the last one, anybody? I, I'm, going to, I'm going to buy these two tablets with this credit card. Okay, I am. I, oh, sorry. I'm going to buy these or this two tablets yeah. with this or this credit card. This credit card. Okay, guys. How how do do you differentiate the pronunciation between the the last two words? This ones. For me, I'm going to buy this two tablets 
with this this with this this play card this okay. let let me underline them yes we got this yes. one is correct and we got this one is also this. correct yes okay that's that's how they go grammatically speaking that's how they go okay let, let's review them let's review them number one those is correct because the next word the, the next word is plural okay steps is plural so we need those okay the same thing here big desk only one desk so we're using that in the singular form and in this case this refrigerator is only one refrigerator so we use the singular form here we use this because we're using two tablets excuse me because we're using two tablets two two tablets you see it's a number two yes and in here we're just using one credit card so we use a singular form because we are talking about only one object very good now my question is como diferencian la pronunciación de las últimas dos bueno las que están en la cuatro como las diferencian ustedes la, la pronunciación the pronunciation dos no las últimas las últimas mm, in number this. four This, 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 this. Okay, somebody said it, somebody said it, yes. Uh, many people confuse these two words or they tend to, to uh, mispronounce them and they are really simple. You know how they are, singular and plural. We got look, this word and this. Okay, yes. Uh, well, it's easy, it's easy. Let me tell you in Spanish, la I, la I en muchas ocasiones se pronuncia como E, E, all right? It's not, it's not I in English. No es I en inglés. Se pronuncia como E, uh, E, uh, this, this. No es, no es la primera. I'm talking about the first one. I'm talking about the first one. Okay, here. The first one. This. This. That's the pronunciation. This. This. And the pronunciation of the second word is these. These. Okay, this, these. You see, you hear the difference? This, these. Esa E in uh, la primera palabra suena como una E, this. And over here, it's the other way around it sounds like an E in Spanish. These, okay. Do you understand the difference? Yes. Yes. Okay. Thank you. Thank you. This. 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 Yes. This yes, is plural. This is singular. Yes. I'm going to get to that part right now. I'm okay. going to get to that part right now. Yes. So that's what we had in the book. Now, we got it here in uh, page number 20. On page number 20, we got part number four that says how to use demonstrative pronouns. How to use demonstrative pronouns. Okay, let me show you how, how do you, use. how, what is the pronunciation? Demon? Demonstrative. Demonstrative. Like mons. Demonstrative pronouns. Demonstrative pronouns. Like trative. Demonstrative pronouns. Muy, very good. We, we got four in this case. We have four. We have four pronouns. Those are, hey, those are, esos son. Those are this, these, that, and those. That information is here. Let me show it to you. Look. Uh, the most of the pronouns, this, that, these, and those. We use the most of the pronouns to show the existence of something or someone at a place. Look, to show the existence of something or someone at a place. Then the information says, we use, we use this and that in the singular form 
We use these and those in the, the plural form. Okay. You have to remember that the short, the short words, this and that, are for singular. Singular objects, singular animals, or singular people. And that the long words, uh, these and those, are for plural things, plural animals, and plural people. I like this shirt. I like this shirt. Okay. Shirt is one. Okay. It's singular. That's why, that's why we use this. Okay. Me gusta esta camisa. We are demonstrating, demonstrating. Okay. Yes. He loves that laptop. He loves that laptop. Singular. El ama o le encanta esa computadora portátil. Yes. O le encanta. Yes, that's what it is. Okay. Excuse me. Tony bought those Gucci bracelets. Wow. He has, he has money. Okay. Tony bought those Gucci bracelets. Bracelets is plural. Okay. Brazaletes. So, in that case... This is why we're using those, okay? Because well, bracelets is plural, we need a plural word. And those is that plural word. Celia needs these coins. Celia requiere estas monedas. Celia needs these coins, okay? So let me uh, repeat this again. This and that are used for singular things. These and those are used for plural things things okay yes that's how they go look more explanation singular we use again we use this and that we got the object is near when the object is near you know what near is when the object is near we use this to demonstrate when the object is far from us we use that to show or demonstrate that the object exists, okay? But when we use that, oh, sorry. When we use this, it's because the object is maybe in our hands or close to us. When we use that, it's because the object is not close to us. It's just in a distance and we cannot maybe reach it. We just point at it, you know, or at them, depending on how far they are. So let me continue. Plural form, these are, oh, example. This is an apple, that is an apple. These are apples. These are apples. The object is near, you're touching them, you're touching the apples, or you have the object in your hands. So that's why you're using this. The object is far, those are apples. It's because, you know, the apples are far, are far from you or they are not close to you, so you have to point at them. Yes. Okay. Do you guys have any questions? Any questions? No, teacher. No, teacher. Okay, fantastic. No, teacher. It's fine. Thank you very much. Don't worry. We're going to get to the practice part. More about it, like more and more about it. Yes, but this time, this time I'm showing it to you with the verb be. As you can see, this, that, oh, those and these plus the verb be is and are. Um, in this case, doesn't apply. This is, this is, all right? This is, esto es, esto es, o esto está. For example, this is hard. Esto está complicado, o eso está difícil, okay? That is... That is eso es o eso está, plus singular, as you can see. Those are, esos son, o esos están, okay? Plural, plus plural. These are, estos son, o estos están, plus plural. These are, all right? We can make, we can make only one contraction here. The contraction that we can make is that. That's the only contract. That's you see. That's the only contraction that we can make. Okay. Yes. That's the only one. Oh well, you got it right there, right? Connect. We can make a contraction with that is. That's not había visto en la tienda. 
Very good. Let's move on. Okay, look, I have many words here, a lot of vocabulary. I'm going to read all the words to you, and then we're going to practice using this, that, those, and these. Picture, bottle, farm, plane, friend, car, shower, seed, store, idea, shop, friend again. Okay, friend, journey, month, king, film, father, day, path, plant, candy, fill, litter, uh, dog, egg, task, bottle, case, job, river, week, painting or painting, city, dream, answer, apartment, actor, year, plate, job, month again, month is here, Win window again, okay, I, did, I saw window somewhere over here. Window, child, hat, film again, toilet, book, uh, kitchen, adult, hole, page, bill, chest, town, dog, machine, cigarette, finger, box, castle, field, spot, lake, eye, dress, chapter, noun, cat, finger, mirror, day, book, boy, hat, corner, message, handle, college, problem, face, wall, candle, daughter, Animal, tomatoes, apartment, bird, toothbrush, lake, bus, and club. Yes. If you have uh, any questions about these words, let me know. No, we're okay. We are okay. Okay, excellent, excellent, fantastic, it's good. But look at the yellow letters. Can you see the yellow letters? I think you can see them. It says they provide an example using the most different nouns. We're gonna have, uh, yeah, yes. I need you guys to give me very, very interesting examples, not simple examples like, like the ones I'm going to give you next. This is a book that's uh that's very very simple give me something something more complicated all right for example this english this english course okay Look, examples, like, I want more complex examples. Like, look at the example I sent to you. This English course is a piece of cake. No. It's like you, you're providing more vocabulary. You're you're uh, giving me more, you know, like, this book is, this is a book. No, that's too easy. <laughs> okay, people. <laughs> let's use, let's use, let's use one, one by one. Like, like, one example, one example. We don't have four examples. One example per each word. One example with this, one example with that, one example with those, and one example with these. Yes. I don't like it, those tomato. I don't like those tomatoes. tomatoes. Those tomatoes. Why not? Well, it is true. Tomatoes are bad. I don't like tomatoes. It's only a sentence, teacher. <laughs> <laughs> I, take, I take everything personal. <laughs> I believe everything. <laughs> okay guys uh, if you want you can write them down I'm going to give you two minutes because it is easy but remember give give me complex examples I don't want like a, something very easy that is my system no I, I, teacher, I teacher. Yeah. Uh, it, it's uh... It's each for for words. This... One example. One example per for each word. Okay. One example per each word. One example with okay. this. One example with that. One example with those, and one example with these. Yes. You can write anything, okay, about anything. As long as you give me an example, we're gonna be okay. Inio yo. <laughs> It was just like the wind and everything. Puro viento.
teacher one question. How many examples do we need to do? Four examples, four. One for each word. Oh, okay. Yes. Any word? Yeah, yeah about anything. About anything, okay. yes. Yeah, that is is a sombrero in English and yes, Spanish, no. right? Okay. Exactly, exactly. Yes. How many? Me? How many example, teacher? One example per each word. Okay. Yes. Guys, are you ready? Yes, teacher. Yes, teacher. Fantastic. Yes. I'm writing my example. Wait. My last one. Uh, those. Those children. Okay. I just shared with you my, my examples in the chat. If you see a mistake, let me know. Might be a finger mistake. Okay, yes. Let me see, let's start sharing. Iniciamos con la compartición. Let's see, let me choose a person. Mayra, you are the first one. Hello, um, I like this candy. Okay, I like? This, this candy. Candy, right? Or candy? Candy. Okay, candy. Okay. And I visit that apartment. Mm -hmm. And I like these tomatoes. These tomatoes. Okay. And. Mm -hmm. And does my daughter okay? And that's my daughter. Mm -hmm. All right, thank you, Maida, for your examples and for your participation. Let's move on. Carlos Eliezer, are you there? Are you available? Yes, teacher, I'm here. Okay, can you share? I uh, sorry, I don't hear you. Can you share the examples that you have? Ah uh, yes. Um, and the num uh, the number one I write that that boy is crying. Uh, these children dances. This person is fun, and those people um are angry, uh, angry, angry, angry. Angry. Okay, okay. We got it. Thank you for for your examples, Carlos. Excellent. Victoria, go ahead, Victoria. Share your example with us, please. Okay. Um Maria likes uh, this black dog. Antonio loves that romantic music. 
um, we are like those green eyes. Um, we like we like those green eyes. Um, they buy these red shoes. Mm -hmm. Okay. Okay, we got it. We got it. You got it. Thank you for sharing. Thank you very much. Yvette Mendoza, go ahead. Share with us. I have a big problem with this printer. With this printer? Yes. Okay. <laughs> only one. <laughs> you have only one? No teacher. No teacher. I need to oh, sell yeah. this car and buy that. He's happy to make people. <laughs> <laughs> I need to sell this car and buy that. I need to. I need to sell. I need to. I need to to sell this car and buy that. Okay. Okay. Thank you for sharing. Let's continue down here with. Uh, let me see if Yancy finished. Yancy? No. Okay, Ismael, go ahead, Ismael. Okay. And the first one, I bought this plan to my daughter. Mm -hmm. Second one, Mary cook those eggs for today's dinner. I don't know if the sentence is correct. Yeah, yeah, continue. Okay. I like this hat to make a present to my father. Mm -hmm. Can you give me this page to write, please? Okay. You got it. Thank you for sharing. Uh, Melanie? Yes, teacher. Share, please. This is a nice apartment. Okay. No, this is... That... that, that this is, is... Okay, sorry. That is a great college. That is, sorry? A great college. Oh, I'm very college, okay. This, these are my best friend. Okay. Those are excellent films. Okay, those are excellent films. Thank you, Melanie, for sharing. Jorge, are you ready? Yes. Thank you. I need to buy these computer mm -hmm. computers mm -hmm. okay um, i would like to work in that jobs job that job yes okay um i need to eat uh those watermelons no, dos watermelons, two watermelons, wow, <laughs> impossible. <laughs> okay, okay. Me congelé, people. Me quedé congelado. <laughs> And, uh, hello? Hi. Hello? I'm sorry, hello? I was... I was frozen. Me quedé congelado por un ratito. Yeah. Okay. Think uh, you finished, right? I need to buy this car. Okay. You need to buy this car. All right. <laughs> yes. Very good. Thank you for sharing. Let me try with Brian. Brian, are you ready? I think he's not. Let me see. Diana, Jamile. Hello. Okay. Yes, go um, ahead, please. Okay. 
This window is very big. Um, Those windows are, or yeah. that window is. This window is very big. Okay. Um, the chicken is my favorite. Mm -hmm. um, this apartment belongs uh, to my parents. Um, the mirror is my favorite. The last one, please repeat the last one. The mirror is my favorite. This what? Mirror. Sorry. Mirror is my favorite. Mirror, mirror. Mirror, I'm sorry, what? I repeat. <laughs> How you just said, espejo. Ah, mirror. Mirror. Es que le escucho un poco, un poco, no sé cómo con, con, ya está el micrófono. <laughs> it's sí. okay, it's okay, Gana. Thank it's you. Okay. It's fine. Okay. Sara? Okay. Go ahead. Um, I wanna this flight. I want sorry. I wanna or I want to. It's okay. This this plant plant plant. Okay, I want this lens. Say it more. I want uh, this lens. I want this lens. This lens. Mm -hmm. I want this okay. lens. I like those books. Okay. I send this message. Okay. Uh, I wish that mirror. I sorry. I wish wish como de I wish I, I wish that mirror. Okay. Yo deseo este. Yo deseo eh, ese espejo. ¿verdad? Yes, I get. Okay, thank you, people. We're going to stop here. Thank you for your participation. Look. Don't worry, we have more examples. Look, we have very, very easy examples. What is the correct answer here, everyone? A, B, C, or D? A. 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 Yes. By the way, A. that apple looks very delicious. Okay. Yes. Uh, maybe, maybe we have two answers here. You know, we, maybe this is an apple and that is an apple because we don't know if it is far or close to us. <laughs> we don't know, okay? So we can say that A and B are the answers. Yes. Okay, what about this one? We got one A, B, C, or D? D or D. D. Okay, C or, C or D, depending on how close or far the object or the animal is. Okay. Those, these. Depends. The, the, Okay, this is a goat, that is a goat, okay? Yes, we have the, the animal there, okay? Look, oh, well, in this case, look, we got a finger pointing at the fruit. It's a that, that little. In this case, since we have the finger there pointing at the, at the apple, at the apple, at the orange, uh, we can say that in this case is that, okay? That is an orange. That is an orange. That's orange. What about this one? But well, it says they're near in uh, between this, parentheses. This, this, this is, is a, dog. a dog. This is a dog, right? Yes, this is a dog. Okay, and we don't have more, but we do have, yeah, we have more. Why? What happened? Why did I cancel it? And the last one? This, this, this is my house. This is my house. People, can you say this example? In real life, can you say this example? Like, do you have a house? In my case, this is not my house. <laughs> yeah. Sad. <laughs> okay. It's that... big, my, it's big, this house. My house is, is little. 
Your house is small. Okay. This good. is not my, my house. house. Too. My house is comfortable and, and little. Okay. Very good. We got more. We have this part over here, this activity, but we're going to see if we have time later on. We're going to go back to the book in this moment. If we have time later on, we're going to continue with this activity that we have in the presentation. If we don't have time, then we're not going to do it. Let's continue here. Okay, uh, we're going to continue with part number five that says write the correct demonstrative pronoun. Write the correct demonstrative pronoun. You're going to choose people between this, that, those, and these. Before, antes de decir las cinco, vamos a leer acá. Let me see, let me choose a person que no pueda leer. Denise, are you there? Yes, I'm here. All right. Can you please read the singular part? Okay. I want to buy this computer. We checked this cell phone on the web page. She is going to order that kit for her friend. The company wants to buy that lift. Okay. Thank you for reading. Let me read again. I want to buy this computer. We checked this uh, cell phone on the web page. She is going to order that kit from, uh, sorry, for her friend. And the company wants to buy that lift. Do you remember what lift is? I think I told you what lift was. Do you remember? I don't Elevador. remember, teacher. Elevator. Whoever said it, thank you, Jorge. I think it was Jorge. Thank you. Yes, elevator. Okay, elevator. That is lift. What is kit? This one that we have here. What is kit? It depends on what kind. It's a juego. Juego de herramientas, juego de cocina, juego de eso, like, like, okay, that's a kit. All right. Juego de maquillaje, in this case, I think that's how, that's what, what this example is about. Let me choose another person to, to read the next part, the plural part, Anna, Victoria. Read, please, the plural part. Um, you have to buy these shoes. He can pay with any of these credit cards. They purchased those cards. My coworkers sold those products. Okay, let me read again. Thank you. Thank you very much for your participation. You have to buy these shoes. You, sorry, he can pay with any of these credit cards. They purchased those cards. And my coworker sold that those products, okay? As you can see there, we got plural and singular. All these objects here are singular. Computer, singular, cell phone uh, is singular. Singular, lift is singular. Here, plural, shoes, cards, plural, cars, plural, and products, plural, okay? Do you guys have any questions? If you have no questions, then you are free to continue with part number five. People, let's continue with part number five. I'm going to give you four minutes to finish this part. Four, only four. Or even less, three, only three. Three is perfect.
I'm sorry. Teacher, please. Yes. I'm sorry. I was just doing something real quick. Let me bring it back. There you go. Guys, are you ready? Almost. Finish teacher. Thank you. Okay, people, let's let's see. Let's see what we got. Jorge, can you please read number one? Wait, Jorge and Ana Victoria. Sure. Jorge, Jorge, you are letter A and Victoria is letter B. Okay, sure. Thank you. Uh, <clears throat> okay. Um, do you want to buy this tablet? Yes, I want to buy the black one. Okay, do you want to buy the... Sorry, I'm going to this. Okay, do you want to buy this tablet? Okay, because it's only one tablet. Thank you, Jorge and Anna, for reading. One tablet. Teach. Yes, exactly. Teacher, I have a dude. Okay, what is your... With the, with the pronunciation, it's table. Will oh, you refer... Tablet. Ah, oh, okay. It's tablets, tablets, yes. Tablet. <laughs> tablet. See, we, we know, table, we know. Table we know is see. mesa. Exactly, yes, exactly. We know, we know here at the end will be table, yes. Don't, don't ask me why. <laughs> In English, yes, okay. Why, teacher? <laughs> <laughs> I said, don't ask me why. Ans answer me. <laughs> es como les decía, como el verbo comprar, que es purchase. Y no chase, como el verbo chase, que es seguir, perseguir. Quítate el amor, yo te voy a poner un chum. It changes, Quítatelo. okay, it's different. Quítate. Mm -hmm. Sandra, you hey. read, la, read letter, letter A in the second one, and uh, Diana, letter B. Can I see this jeans? This jeans? Sure, what size? What size? What size? Okay. Will be, can I see this? These jeans. Did you know that, do you know that the word 
the word genes is never singular. The word genes is never singular. If you say gene, you're talking about just one part, okay, half of it. Yes. So genes is never is never singular. Let's continue. Thank you for reading. Myra, read letter A. And Sara, you read letter B, number three. Okay, teacher. My friend and I are interested on that makeup. Okay, Sara. My friend, this is. Or for. Lea, 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 Lea. The small box. <laughs> okay, small box. All right. That right, that makeup. On that makeup. My friend, my friend and I are interested, interested people, interested, interested. I mean, in the chat, I have shared with you a collocation. ¿Saben qué es un collocation? Son palabras que ya van juntas porque así es la, así se ha. Sí es la vida. Así es la vida. Exactamente. In the Because... chat, I just I share the information with you in the chat. It's it's always interested in. No se dice on. Okay, I don't know why on is there, but interested on is not correct. It has to be interested in. That's the correct uh, collocation. Yes. Interested in. Oh uh, well, let's move on. Sometimes you know finger mistakes happen. Carlos of uh, uh, Alberto. Number four. Yes, teacher. Number four. Um, did you bring this uh, package? Pa package? Package. Package. Did you bring? Did you bring this package? Yes, I did. Did you bring this package? Yes, yes okay. I did. Yes. Thank you for reading, Eliezer. Carlos Eliezer, read number five. Uh -huh. Um, you can add um, the four squidder uh, to the charts. Okay, you can't. You can't add yes. those. Those. You can add. You can add those four sweaters to the charts. What is chart, people? Chart, what is chart? Ahí está en el número cinco. Carrito de compras, creo. Yes, yes. Okay. Very good. Oh, uh, okay. But can I take two? Puedo llevar dos. All right. Thank you for reading. Let me see another person that can. Diana. Number six, Diana. I had to go. To buy two new books at uh, the library. I have to go buy two. Okay, yes, because Juice. she doesn't new have book. because the person doesn't have the books in, in his or her hands. Yes. I have to go I have to go buy those new books at the library. Mm -hmm. I'm going okay. with you. Okay, people, we got them all. Excellent, thank you. Thank you. Great job. Do you have any questions? Yes, I have a question with the number four. Number four, all right. Show me or uh, tell me. I think the package is far because the bear is brain. I think, I don't know. Repeat, I'm sorry. I think the package is is far. So. Mm, yeah, it depends on the context of how you want to take it. Como, hey, trajiste este paquete? Or, did you trajiste ese paquete? Like, it depends I on. Think, on, I, I think, on the sure I think it's not, it's, it's not, it's not uh, necessary. This or, is a, uh, this or can be a, uh, 
Yeah, it but, can be uh, that. I think, uh, but I, it, 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 it's more logic. This, for me, I don't know. It, it, yeah, but uh, it, it's a pen. Yes. Like right. it's 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 very very mm -hmm. well. It's not it's not that ambiguous. It's just these two words. But yeah, sometimes yes. right. We can we can use both. Yes, yes. Depending on the context. Okay. Now, I believe that there are no more questions. So let me raise that, and we're going to continue down here with part number six. This is the last part. It says there create a conversation. With a partner, one is a customer and the other an agent. Pretend you want to order something online and you describe the agent, the product you are seeing on the internet. Okay? People, that's the activity that we have right now. Yes. Oh, uh, let me see. Stop sharing. Okay. So do you understand the activity? Guys, do you understand yes. the activity? Yes, teacher. Yes, teacher. Okay, excellent. Let me see. Let me make the groups to work individually or in groups. If uh, there is a person who is not talking or saying anything, maybe that person is not available for participation. If that is the case, please ask for help and I will help you, all right? In that case, I will move you to a different group or I will move that person to another group and I'm going to bring another one to your group. Let's do that, shall we? People, I just created the groups, let's go. I'm going to be monitoring everyone, so people be ready. Do not speak Spanish. Eh, uno habla y como y tiene que, que, que hablarle a su supervisor o algo así y ahí entra la otra persona como uh, transfer the call ajá para, okay. bien, para, para hablar los tres uh -huh. hello Hi. hello I do not exist <laughs> ok Ignore me. <laughs> okay. 
Okay, George. Do you start the conversation? Si lo la otra vez. No. Empezó, no sé si está ahí. A de de phone. Yes. Um. Podríamos empezar, no sé, diciendo como Hello, good evening. Uh, could you help me, please? Y usted me dice, Of course. Uh, how, how can I help you? Y yo le digo, I need, uh, I need pay, pay the, the new phone or cell okay. phone. Okay. Uh, I'm sure. Um... Y usted me dice si va a ser tío o dije <laughs> Okay. <laughs> and, and the iPhone. Teacher. Teacher. Hi. What is the power? The conversation. What well, the conversation? The page. Yes, the page. The page. The conversation. Oh, yeah. When you're going to do, you're gonna. Pretend you are ordering something online. Yes. Será como un tipo de llamada que usted está pidiendo algo en línea. Pero nosotros lo vamos a inventar. Exactly, exactly, yes, of course. Ah, okay. Okay. Oh, I didn't allow this. Allow you guys to share. Let's see if I can compartir the pantalla. Okay, so I can start. I can say good morning. I want to buy some items from your store. And Sara, you can continue. You, uh, what, which uh, product? Or, ¿cómo puedo decir? ¿Qué producto es que decía? No, no sé. Anything. What product? What product? Do you need? Or do, do you want? Need. Do you need? So, yes. uh, what product do you need? Okay. Okay, the price for the, the, for the washing machine is 400 Four hundred and ninety-nine cents. <laughs> okay. Typical. I, I want it. <laughs> ninety, ninety, ninety. <laughs> ninety-nine cents. <laughs> but if you choose another another product, you have a discount of five percent. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> You're. She's a good seller. She's a good seller. Yeah. <laughs> You <laughs> got the skills. We have a promotion. A what? Sorry. Okay, it's my internet. I'm sorry. Uh, I oh, can yeah. choose the second product. <laughs> No, no, no. Okay. Uh, the washing machine, the, the price of the washing machine is three, 
399.99. Are you agree? Okay. Do, do okay. you agree? Uh, do agree. you agree? Yes. Okay. Yes, I agree. Okay. I, yes, I do. So I'm going to need your complete number, your, I'm sorry, your complete name, and I'm going to need your credit card number, uh, credit card number, and, and what else? Your email. Okay, my name, my complete name is Sandra Yvette Mendoza de Flores. And my number, my credit card is 7777. 7777. Okay, and do you need and uh, delivery? Oh, yeah. I'm sorry, I'm sorry. Uh, my email is... Hmm. <laughs> okay. Okay. The price. Aquí no solo puede decir quizás mm. el laptop. Eh. Y esa... Esa, sí será. Esa, se presenta. Hoy. Hoy, can I help you? Hoy. Is it how? <laughs> What? I don't know. In the first one, Jorge, Here. hi. Thank you for calling to, to the best company. To best company or to the best company? To the best to company. The best. Or se llama así, mm -hmm. Best Company. Yes. Ah, okay. Mm -hmm. ah, eh, eh, no, no, Best Company is the name. Mm -hmm. ah, okay. Ah, so yeah, how, how can I help you? How, how can I help you? How can I help you? Ana, how can I help? Al final, no, al fi eso está bien. Ah. Oh, recuerda que en inglés, en inglés solo vamos a hacer pregunta. En inglés, we only, we only use one question mark in English. Solo usamos un signo en inglés, el último, al final. H, H, O, W. Uh -huh. H, O, W. How, how can I how, help? How, how can I help you? Yes, okay. that's correct. <gasps> <laughs> oh, in the second one, I would like to buy that black laptop. La, the, the article, no, it's a uh, no, uh, uh, Okay. And I need to mm -hmm. buy this. Oh, uh -huh. this. yes. Quitemos la también en la segunda. Tercera, perdón. Vicky. And I need to buy this Nintendo Switch. Okay. Uh, do you know the price? Como sabes el precio? Do you know? Yo ven acá al principio. No. Yes. The price laptops are... Yes. The laptop is 700 and the Nintendo is... Mm -hmm. And that. Yes. That. Anyway, see you later. Hey, okay. Hello. Okay. No, es que me imagine. Verdad. Carlito, can finish? Ahorita voy okay. a Ahorita se nos pasa. Um, the the Hi, question. teacher. Hello. Thank you for cambiarme de grupo, teacher. Aquí estoy bien. Uh -huh. Oh, okay, I'm sorry. No sé en qué grupo estaba cuando se salió y pues la, la, la entrenamos con la que grupo estaba. Thank you, teacher. <laughs>
It's okay. Are you guys ready? ¿Están listos? Um, yes, teacher. Wow, oh, Carlos, excellent. Yes. Oh, my God. Vaya, ahí está. Ya lo mandé. Okay, thank you. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> Hasta mi foto está ahí, Dios mío. Bueno. <laughs> Eso es todo. Sí. <laughs> wow. Okay. Uh, so you are ready. Then. Yes, teacher, we finish. Okay. Yo solo eso voy a decir. Sí. Sí. Seguiré con mi tour, seguiré con mi tour entonces. Oh my God. ¿Cómo, cómo, cómo? Disculpe, no lo escucho. Seguiré con mi tour. Okay, teacher. Los veo en dos minutos. Ready. Almost. Okay. <laughs> we need uh, some a few minutes. A little. Okay. A little. Some minutes. Arab. Some minutes. Some minutes. Okay. I will give you one. Uh, you go to this one. So, but I, I have been in sales before and I was really bad. I remember the um, this this job um there is um you need to, to sell I don't know there is a a skill a skill oh yes yes are you guys ready yes <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, I was just, you know, <laughs> I didn't want to get in the middle of the conversation. So. <laughs> yes. Don't worry, don't worry. But yes, we are ready. I never, I never get worried. I'm always, I'm always happy. <laughs> okay, people, let's let's go back to the main session. Okay. Okay. I will, okay. I will see you there. Okay. Okay, we have to wait for the rest. Uh, a couple of seconds. Let me see how many seconds we have to wait. Well, 30 seconds, 38 seconds. It's, people, I'm hungry. I don't know why. I just ate. I ate two times and I'm hungry. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah, me too. I'm sorry. I'm hungry too. Mm, it's sad. <laughs> it <Yeah>. is sad. <laughs> and I do, I do have food, but the food I have is not really tasty. It's not like uh, so. <laughs> okay, I think everybody's back. Those are more regresado, yes. Okay, we're going to start sharing uh, our activities. Let's start with Victoria. You and your partners or partner. I start for him. For do you have the? Ah, okay. Y Mayra. Uh -huh. No veo a Mayra. She got lost in the way. Yeah, she's now back. No regresado. That's weird. Ahí está. Ok. Mayra. 
It is okay. connecting to audio right mm -hmm. now. Okay, she's ready. Okay. Um, hi. Thank you for calling to Beth's company. How can I help you? Hello. You can hear me. Hello. I can hear you. Hello. Hello, Mayra. Hello. Hola. Hola. Sorry. Okay. Okay, okay. again. Okay. Hi. Thank you for calling to Beth's company. How can I help you? Hi. I I would like to buy that lap, laptop. Hi. And I I need and I need to buy this Nintendo Switch. Do you know the price? The laptop is uh seven hundred. And that uh, Nintendo is uh, forty fifty hundred dollars. Yes, for the money is no problem. Okay, can I get your credit card number, please? Yes, the number uh, credit card is twenty twenty two twenty 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 three twenty three. Uh, 2030, uh, 2045. Please give me your address. Yes. Uh, 517 West L Street, Decatur, Texas. Uh, 76234 is that State United of America. Okay, that's all. Thank you for your buying, for your thank shopping. You. Okay, thank Bye. you. Bye. Okay, thank okay. you. Thank you, Victoria, Jorge, and Maida for your participation. Yes. Quisiera poder decir, el piso no es problema. Quisiera poder decir eso yo. Okay, money is not a problem. <laughs> money is not a problem. <laughs> okay. okay. Yeah, that easy, that easy, right? Maida es la del dinero. <laughs> Yeah, oh, I know. Yes. Okay, very good. Thank you. Uh, let me continue with Ismael. Ernesto? Okay, teacher. Sarah, are you ready? Yes, I'm ready. Okay. Good morning. I want to buy some items from your store. Hey, what uh, product do you need? I'm looking for a new cell phone. In this story, have a different cell phone. What mark uh, do you need? Oh, I need a Huawei cell phone. Uh, this is the price of our product, but my convoker had you a uh, help help you with this information oh okay how is my my name is Raquel. i will play take your information what is your address okay my address is second avenue street number five in front of gas station san salvador okay what what your what your pay credit card or cash? Ah, uh, I'll I'll pay with cash. Okay, thank you. Okay, thank you. Okay, you finish. Ismael, Raquel, and Sara, thank you both for well, three of you. Sorry, for your participation. Excellent. Let's continue with one more group, Sandra. I think you are going to be the last one. Okay, with the need. Okay, yes. Ring, ring, hello, this is Simon. How can I help you? Hello, Denise. Um, 
I need to buy a washing machine. Okay. Uh, can you give me the number that you saw on the web page? Yes, I call. Um, the number is twenty-five seventy-eight ninety-six thirty-five by eight and say six. Okay, so you are so you want to buy a Samsung washing machine. Uh, for that product, we have it in three colors. We have black, white, and pink. What color do you want? I prefer in color black. Okay. So the price of that washing machine is $399.99 with 99 cents. Do you agree? Yes, I agree. Okay. Can you give me your credit card, credit card number, please? Okay, my, my number credit card is 777777. And can you give me your full name? My full name is Henry Beth Mendoza de Flores. Uh, okay, do you want delivery service? Yes, please. Can you give me your address, please? My address is Avenue Las Carmelitas. Okay, so the purchase is done. You are going to receive your product in two days. Thank, Thank you for you calling. Bye-bye. Thank you. <laughs> excellent, people. Excellent. Thank you. Thank you. Amazing. All right. Well, uh, do you have any questions? No? Okay. I'm sorry to announce the winner for today. I mean, the, the person who is going to stay after class <laughs> the winner is the niece. Yes. Yay! Congratulations. <laughs> Congratulations. Yes. I'm okay. sorry. Okay. Uh, please don't leave. All right. Stay. Uh, let me take attendance, people. After that, we will be dismissed. Uh, Ana Victoria. Galan. Present. Yes. Uh, Melanie Portillo. Present teacher, good night, everybody. Thank you, good night. Uh, Brian David Ramirez. Present teacher. Carlos Alberto Orrego. Apparently he left because of internet problems. Carlos, no lo vemos, no está. I think he left because of the internet, because of his Wi-Fi. Uh, Carlos Eliezer Dimas. Denise Alejandra Zuniga. Present. Thank you. Diana Yamilet Maravilla. Present teacher. Yes, thank you. Edith Adilia Hernandez. Ismael Ernesto Boyad. Present teacher. Good night, everybody. Good night. Jorge Ernesto Hernandez. Present teacher. Thank you. Mayra Elizabeth Lazo. Present teacher. Thank you, Rafael Alejandro Morales. I think he was not here today. Raquel Elizabeth de la Rosa Rodriguez. Yes, thank you, Sandra Ives Mendoza. Present teacher. Thank you, Sara Darcel, Rachel, Rachel Salazar. Present. Yes, Jancy Andrea Solorzano. Okay, we don't know. People smile. We are free to go, except Denise. Okay. <laughs> People, thank you very much for being here today. Yes, I really, really appreciate your effort. I will see you guys tomorrow. Have a good night. Sleep, rest, and be happy. All right. Good night, everyone. Good night, everybody. Bye bye. Good night. See you tomorrow. Have a good dreams. See you. Yes, bye bye. Bye bye. <laughs> they left quickly. <laughs> wow they were sleepy hungry or they wanted coffee i don't know or the soap opera <laughs> all right i think elise is not really uh, available right now it's just oyente right next to her name so denise we have a couple of minutes to see if you have any uh, confusion questions complication about any topic or uh, any english topic 
uh, I mean, the topics that we have studied or any other topic that you might have any uh, problems with. So, yes. Um, I think sometimes I get confused with some verbs, maybe in past tense, or when I have to say something in future. And I think I make mistakes with nouns too. Mm -hmm. For example, for uh, I was saying we and and I I need to say I. Mm -hmm. So something like that, but I, I I don't know how to practice that. No, in that case, you you, you have to practice by uh you speak, man. You have to speak. Yes. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. The person, what, whoever, whoever you speak to, this person, this person, if this person speaks English, this person is going to completely understand what you're saying, even though you are making mistakes. Like, for example, I know you guys make mistakes. I make mistakes too sometimes. Yes, I make mistakes. It's normal. Yes. But you don't have to worry about making a mistake because I understand you. So I will be here to correct you. I right? Yes, that's what I'm here for, to correct you. But you're doing a good job. You're doing a good job. Yes. I'm really, really glad. And uh, what's the word I'm looking for? Satisfied. That's the word I'm looking for. I'm really satisfied okay. with your performance, with everything you've done. You're be doing a great job. Yes. What you have to do is practice more. Uh, watch series or videos, listen to music, you know, get involved with the language. Yes. Actually, I, I do that. Uh, I, I never studied English. The English that well, I studied English when I was like a little kid, mm -hmm. but all the English that I know is because I see a lot of movies or, or I listen to music, and always in English, in English. Yes. And now, uh, I'm trying to like think in English everything. Like, if I am, <laughs> I don't know, cooking, I I speak to myself and I say so the things in English. Mm -hmm. I say the things in English and yes. some things like that. And... That's, that's a, I did that too. When I was learning, I, I did that too. I used to speak, talk to myself. I like I was kind of crazy though. But <laughs> uh, the point the point for me was to practice and to learn to learn new things. I downloaded a dictionary on my cell phone and I had a dictionary and when I was doing something I was like wait how do you say, for example, hey, how do you say plancha in English? I have my cell phone next to me, so what I used to do is like, look for the word in English, like, okay, mm -hmm. I got it, iron, 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 iron. And I Then I uh, used to leave the, 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 the place. When mm -hmm. I come back, like, oh, hey, iron, uh, you're practicing mm -hmm. by yourself. Okay, okay. Yes. maybe, maybe you're not going to practice 100% uh, perfect pronunciation, what you're going to practice here is like like uh memorizing the word and knowing what the word is, yes. Okay. Then the pronunciation will be you know improved uh with practice. Yes. Okay. 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 Uh I would like to recommend some, some some things though. Music, classic music is good. Classic music. I will recommend some uh uh modern groups. For example, I have uh Coldplay, that one is good. You should listen to Coldplay. You should listen to uh, Adele. That one is good too. This this uh, group, uh, Imagine Dragons. I'm oh, talking okay. about like new music, right? New music that they have. Like the English is good. Yes, yes. Okay. A boy is into just... hip hop and rap. That that nah. <laughs> no, really I tried to, to to sing uh, one of that songs, but it was really hard. It, it's, it's really so hard it's really hard yes yeah. it helps it helps though it helps you with the pronunciation when you like like they are going really fast and you're learning how to speak fast yes i don't yes. speak fast in english i speak uh, fast in spanish because i have a problem in my tongue and i cannot really pronounce the words in spanish but i try <laughs> intento intento <laughs> doesn't make you go something but i do i try yes okay so that's what you so, should do. You should learn a word every day. One word that you don't know, on a piece, of, write it on a piece of paper, put it in your purse or in your pocket, and have it there the whole day. Yes, maybe you will learn that word or memorize it that day. 
Yes, like okay. one word every day. Yes. Mm -hmm. Okay, okay. Yeah. Okay, teacher. I've been asking everyone, do you have any recommendations to improve the sessions? Uh, I don't think so. I like think any, like any activity that you would like me to include, like I haven't included any listening activities or reading. I have included just uh, like like uh, writing, you know, writing and, and, uh, and speaking, oh, yes. writing mm -hmm. and speaking. But I, have, I haven't uh, brought any listening activities or reading activities. OK, so that's why I'm asking for recommendations, you know, for what, what you guys would like me to 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 bring, yes. Well, in my case, uh, I think the listening is, it's like, it's not a, a big problem for me. I think I, I understand everything, but um, maybe, I don't know. I, I, I don't know, I think, I think I'm, I'm okay with the class. Um, in my case, my problem is the speaking. So, and we are speaking a lot. So, you're speaking is not a problem. You're speaking with me right now. <laughs> no problem. <laughs> hey, you're speaking with me with no problems. You don't, you shouldn't be worried. You shouldn't be worried. You should be happy. <laughs> you should be happy. This is module number four. This is not mo module number four. I have been with students that are in advance and even superior levels, and they don't speak anything. Yes. And you, okay. it's still basic, you're still beginner, and you're speaking well. Yes. Well, most of you, most of you in the class are. Most of you in the class are. Yes. That's really good. Yes. Yes. So in my case, I don't have anything like... Well, actually, I, I do the three things. I listen, I write a lot of things. And I speak, so I think I have covered covered all all the things. Okay, that's amazing then. So, yeah, so I don't have any recommend recommended. I don't know okay. how to say that. Recommendations. Ah, uh, recommendation. Yes. Recommendations. We can say ideas. Easy. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Well, uh, Denise, thank you very much for staying for these couple of minutes. Uh, it has been a pleasure. I will see you tomorrow and have a good night. Okay. okay. Thank you. Good night. Bye-bye. Bye. -bye. Bye.